Again, he misses the point. <laughs> Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in Storycraft. We are, we are leaving. leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> well, that was educational. <laughs> Let us leave this place. Happily. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy... Will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. <laughs> Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. <laughs> Look, I think we're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya... I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe... The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norns. Find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. 
Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake. Though, I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. Now tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? Oh dear, oh dear, what's to be done? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses. Quiet. Uh, what else might there be to discuss? You're back. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. Whatever you need. Always a joy to work on these. May it strike true. Anything for Freya? Hope it's to your liking. Kratos? Whatever you need, I'll create. Wear it with pride. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. What can I make for you? And for the Valkyrie Queen? I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. 
Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need it. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch Dropnir. Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will this help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artists. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horde that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we and should... And it's just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim again. the materials not to mention we'll have to visit the lady oh Ooh. Ooh, that's a relief <laughs> huh? Ow. Kratos whenever you're ready No idea what he's on about, brother. I wish you'd come to see you out there. Ah, 
Time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh, no. This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you have to. heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What was all that then? Oh, just Sindri trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in neither Valir been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursioning you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates did never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. <laughs> Unusual surface here. Elvish, I think. Keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Guess we'll have to blast our way out. That barrel by the gate should do the trick. <laughs> so, a tunnel for liquor and explosives. Little on the nose for dwarven culture, isn't it? Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, right. Oh. Right down that one. Oh. Oh. why it's an abandoned service tunnel. <laughs> Careful, bro. That looks flammable. Another oil spill. 
fortuitous oil spill. to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But... Oh, dear. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again! You're insinuating, and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The Giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. We're each entitled to our opinion. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture.
sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. We'll need to get one of those gates open. <laughs> ah, we've seen these troughs before, haven't we, brother? That worked, shall we? This opinion of yours, was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok? That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting I my... know. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take. Sigil arrows won't work on this. Sigil arrows won't work on this. Careful! Those Grim are possessed by nightmares. They'll be even more dangerous until we stun them. Watch your left! 
Sigil arrows won't work on this. They got the third one hidden away. Those swim are possessed by nightmares. They'll be even more dangerous until we stun them. <laughs> Atreus's mother was a giant, isn't that right? She was one of the Yogar. Yes. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with the disparity in size. Or number of limbs, say. Nothing in the world. Now we can open the other gate. Why is it, you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. 
nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping them once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything you haven't <laughs> thought. Her secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talked to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the past This is sheep. mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. You're right. Incoming right side! <laughs>
ready for some fresh air after that. Everyone. I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about that. <laughs> When we get out of here, I'll give you some space. Let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon, and to use it. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'll see what else I can learn while we're here. Maybe I'll send a few Ain Hair Yar back to Valhalla for good measure. Well. You have fun now. Hey, you made it! About time. I got everything all set here. Now we just gotta push on up to the fort. Falky! Long as you know that ain't the way to the fort. Take your fancy dance, <laughs> Think I don't mind stretching my legs? <laughs> Catch up with you any damn time I like. Better take out that death or it'll be eyeball city out here. <laughs> To that trick. Locals up ahead. Act civilized and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, quit your nattering, you snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear. Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? Well, that ain't. You see what's wrong here, don't you? Those creepy flying eyeballs made a nest up on the cables. We gotta figure a way up there and clear them all. Well, this sure is exciting to watch, but you know that's out of range, right? Like that wheel up there opens the gate. Not that we can reach it or anything. Mm. No grappling up there. Why don't you look around and see if there's a way to lift this lift? Hang on, coming around. 
Brother, did you notice the dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Block than they were to see you? They did seem surprised. All right. Now I can turn this plane just to the guy. Just give me this signal. Now. On it! He is dead! We gotta have a close stop with one, see? Ah, promising. Turn it! Copy that! Crank cover. You do the other stuff. Turn it again. Aye, aye. Once more. Aye, aye. Again. What? Get the angle you needed to find down there. You'd have found it all. Got the crank covered. You do the other stuff. What? If the angle you needed to find was down there, you'd have found it already. Come on through it! 
I think they seen us. Whoa. Up with your brother! Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Ah. Yeah. Finally! Now we can ride on up to the fort. Come on! The lady's waiting. Hey! Got another river for you. What gets bigger, the more you take away from it. Well, let's see. Something abstract, I expect. Appetite? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> stump the stump. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? Bam pot. Ooh, that's brisk. Think I'll grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Oh. Watch and learn! See? Dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? The nature of a thing's more important than the form of a thing. <laughs> Hang on! I smell trouble. Show me what you got! You're behind! Magical creature in this whole realm. Why, I've been waiting for my chance to meet her since I was knee high to a Noken. But Sindri had never had it, said I was too uncouth. Oh. Today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> Why, bro, I've never seen you so reverent. Are you nervous? What? Shut up! No! Up here. It does not work. Huh? What is it this time? Out of the way! Let me look. Oh, fuck no. Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city my own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow me. Yeesh. This place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. This lady, what does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessing. Doesn't give them to every piece, but the ones she does, there's something to behold. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster, huh? Maybe sometime I'll spin you that tale.
He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Back in those days, I'd get so caught up in trying to be the best that I'd work till I won't drop. Time goes by and there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own pace. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Like for when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. Gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right. Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope. What do you mean, nope? Desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, it's not perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me that easy. <laughs> All right, let's get back to business. One more crank to turn and it's on to the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to the nature of one. I was almost following him for a moment there. We're good! Crank it! She needs the final ingredient. The blood of a god. Give her your... Victor, almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might 
blessed worse. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? What the fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. A part specifically you might be missing. Fuck. Fuck! Damn it, Sindri, you lion's cat scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! The fuck you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters, not its form. All right. May this weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. Now you know I can't let you take our new gal home without giving us a world. Look! We got volunteers! I felt that one come up. <laughs> now you know I can't let you take our new gal home without giving us a world. Look! We got volunteers! That's the stuff! Ain't your first time with the spear, I reckon! It is the first weapon I've fought to learn! What the hell? Ain't it didn't just like old time! Couldn't have put it more forebodingly myself. There you go. 
Yeah. Guess we're doing this one boy style. Now listen, uh, I appreciate what you said back there. It's good to have friends when you find out your brother's a rack stabbing liar. No doubt he only wished to protect you. Word his call to me. The guy dies, he's got the right to know about it. Take heart, Brock. We all die sometime. Many of us more than once. No, never mind all that. We gotta finish putting the spirit through our paces. Come on! Might have to get creative up ahead. That one's nastier than drunk! Oh, lick my stick! There's eyeball nests all of them! Get your throwing arm in here! Incoming! I broke ya! Ah! Good there! Get the dang ass! On your legs! Ah! 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 the more you take away. Ah, is it time? <laughs> because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No, that's bollocks now that I say it. Never mind. <laughs> Today's all right. Them eyeballs are taking over their ground. We'd better beat them out. <laughs> Yep. Look out for that. 
Got one last favor to ask of the boat, but then we can call a square. What happened down there in the forge with the lady? That's my story to tell, all right? Agreed. Oh, very well. <laughs> These ugly bugs. Maybe those grim will take him down.
come back. These are great birds. Maybe those drill will take you down.
boy, that's probably enough heart pumping for me today. You pick up the loot. I'll set up shop over yonder. I see a shorter path. Aye. Shall we let Brock improve your gear before we go? Thank you, Brock. It is a good spear. Damn straight it is. And I see how you'll be getting down. And I'll get those gates working for you. I only hope Sindri's in one piece by the time Brock's done with him. The ice beneath those two is thin enough under the best of circumstances. Where is everyone? Now a good time. I just want to talk. Dad to dad. Speaking of which, imagine my surprise when Atreus came knocking at my door. <laughs> He's doing well, by the way, and will continue to do so just as long as I return to Asgard sometime soon. Besides, our friend here has a has a whole lot to live for. Arguable. Run along now, but behave yourself. <sighs> New spear. Never much cared for Brock. Can't deny the dwarf's talent. You came to speak. Speak. You don't really want war, do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands on your son's hands. I want peace as much as you do. Perhaps we can find it together. He's lying. I know. That boy of ours is everything I expected. So clever, kind. You sure he's yours? A kid, you really ought to be very proud. He is the key to peace in our age, to break free from all this fate and prophecy. My son is not your key. Oh, God, do they not have metaphor in your homeland? Or rather, did they? I'm sorry, that's not fair. I know you're not the god you once were. And now is your chance to prove it. Return my son, or you may meet the god I once was. And what kind of god is that, Kratos? What do you even know of godhood? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! You don't care about mortals. 
You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. You fear what you can never even hope to understand. Is it any wonder that your boy is in no rush to come back to you? Don't listen to brother. He's just trying to get in your head. Superior bastard. The nerve of him showing up here. At least you rattled him as much as he rattled you. Good timing. Let's see what Brock made you. Brock! So that's the weapon? A drop near spear? The drop near spear. Well, any given number of drop near spears, I suppose. <sighs> Come on, I found a gate. We just need to take the train down. I do worry, though, if I'm being frank. We've crafted a weapon to kill a god. One could say you're on the verge of returning to form. Does it scare you, aiding another violent god? I'm scared for you, brother. That spear could start a war. THE war. If that no longer concerns you, then maybe Freya's right. Maybe the Giants had you in mind all along. Not tell me! Oh, nasty heck! You all right, brother? Oh, 
So this drop near Spear, you're prepared to use it? To protect Atreus. I am no one's champion but his, nor no one's god. That may be my form. It is not my nature. Do you understand? I guess a difference of opinion is hardly the most I'm setting aside for this alliance. As long as the plan is to kill Heimdall, the rest matters little. There's also the bit of news that Odin has some inkling of what we're up to. I thought I heard ravens. Damn it. What did he say? Lies, threats, and more lies. What did you expect? You think he lies that Atreus is in Asgard? No. On that, I'm afraid I believe him. Then the rest matters little. I saw a gateway near here, overlooking the bay. We can get to it with your spear, I think. This way. That gravestone. There's a keyhole that looks to fit that old. Prepare for a fight. Nothing to feel the callus. <laughs> oh, the key! <laughs> Scared? <laughs> I warned you. Come on, Kratos. Off your back. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
have to feel the callous. For the king! <laughs>
the field of talent. For the king! Weak darling! Yeah! <laughs> 
Bag. You knew this warrior. Do me a favor, brother. You see any more of these ghostly berserker tossers, give them the same. You'll be doing the Nine Realms a favor. Did these warriors wrong you at some point, Mimir? You're quite agitated, even for you. No need to rehash ancient history if it's all the same to you. Very well. Hey, big guy. Speak. Need you to get something for me. A hammer. A weapon? No. A forge hammer. Little thing. Symbol of the old resistance. Yield, solidarity, all that. Or it used to be anyway, till the Aesir buried it under that big gaudy dwarf statue in the bay. Might do the dwarves some good to see it again. You're not worried that might draw the Ain Haryar's attention? The old father nearly slit my throat just to get to you. I might be both giving a shit what he thinks. Just find me at the bar when you've got it. You'll certainly be able to reach new areas in the bay with that spear. 
Aye, might be worth looking for Darlin's hammer while we're at it. Your choice, of course. Ah, with the mining rigs disabled, it seems a bit fresher out here. That seems... is. I... You're right. Thanks, brother. If memory serves, we're heading in the right direction to find that large dwarven Alpha. statue. Dunlin's hammer shouldn't be far behind me.
not the first time someone's told me that, I suppose. Is that why you haven't moved on? My son. I suspect. Please find him. You may help yourself to the treasure. It doesn't matter to me. We were sailors. We left Midgard to seek our fortunes elsewhere. We were so close to succeeding. The sun is surely gone by now. It costs us little to make sure. Really? Oh! Uh. 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 Uh.
off, Matt. You've got this. Can't do this without you, Kratos. Beautiful from up here. <laughs> Brother, another rune slate. Peace after all this time. Unlike Durlin's resistance, I suppose. We will take this to him. from 
off, man. You've got that. <laughs> We'll have to find a way through this debris. <laughs> the broken Muspelheim seat is now complete. We should find a mystic gateway. Perhaps we'll find Surtur's combat challenges. Get that thing to shut up!
creatures and all the debris. No one could have made it out of here alive.
creatures and all their ways. No one could have made it out of here alive. scare you or anything. You did not. Right. Uh, you can bring that back to Ratatos group whenever you're ready. The tunnel must open up just ahead. See the rubble from here, brother. Looks like we're in the right place. <clears throat> Quite the sum there, brother. We will find the ghost son. Really? His request isn't a distraction? He does not know his son's fate. I see. Okay, then. Meeting the Lady of the Forge really brought back some memories. I thought it was only in my homeland you'd see such things. Mermaids who forge weapons. Aye. I remember very fondly a late nymph called Minya. Very talented with a sword. Mumia. I meant that literally. Shame on you. She made the best swords in all the Isles and had big dreams about what she'd do with them one day. I wonder what became of her. Oh, 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 oh,
Another Berserker Gravestone.
not worth wasting my breath over. This Berserker champion's even less so. Trash. It's a lot of them. Why wait until now to speak of them? Before, there was nothing to be done. And finding that help changed things. I wasn't quick enough. I'm so sorry I abandoned you. Your father is dead. What? How? He went to find the other treasure on his own, to spare you the dangers. It seems that in your efforts to protect one another, you each came to one of these islands on your own, and... I've been such a fool. But... Thank you, for telling me. Perhaps now... We can see each other again. What a shame. In their attempt to spare the other, they both perished. There is a lesson there. What now? We will retrieve the treasure, then return to the father. What for? To finish what he and his son started. That water wheel's getting no water. I see. The geyser under the water wheel is blocked. appears to be atop that island. Perhaps the treasure the spirit spoke of. up, little one. Does your boss have you spying on us? No, 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 no. That wasn't our intention. You must believe me. I am here solely to serve as a guide, but, but only if you want. It's standard procedure. Well, you can rest easy. We'll get these back to Ratatoska. Thank you. And again, sorry if I offended you. I, I promise I'll be more helpful next time. Jumpy little fellow, huh? We could use that lift, but not while it's up there.
there's a pier. See? Connected to the gate. Good. That'll help with the prey. Quite the cash. I see why it meant so much to our lost treasure seekers. Perhaps we should go tell the father what became of his son. mentioned that Fimble Winter had worn down some of Odin's curses, but you still needed help. Was it Sigrun who helped you recover your warrior spirit? Is that how Odin liked to refer to the curse that kept me from defending myself? Oh, I suppose that is where I had it. Would you like to know how that curse really worked? What it did to me? What it cost me to finally break it? I... I'm no longer sure that I do. That's correct. Kratos... Don't you have a way through that door? Found something good? Yes. I wonder if we shouldn't check back on the raven tree. Son. Oh, please, please, tell me. He died trying to find the other treasure. He didn't know you were doing the same. No, no, no. This is my fault. He disobeyed your wishes. Yes, because that is what sons do. I should have brought him with me. We'd be alive and rich beyond all reason. Together. Don't blame yourself. He is at peace. Nevertheless, thank you for finding him. I'll seek him out in Helheim. I'm glad we did this, Kratos. Yes. And I'm sure Atreus will be as well. Yes. Oh, my God. 
Fair. I assume it was Seekrin, then, who helped you retrieve your Valkyrie wings. Were they hidden in the place, I guess? They were not. But yes, she did. Argued all the while I should let my anger go, but helped me just the same. Headed back to the city? I came by and took out an Einherjar yard patrol. Area should be clear. Can't speak for the rest of town. 
Guess an occupying army is as good as a lockdown for tamping down foot traffic. You again. I hope you're back to clean up the mess that extra head of yours made. We have done it. Doesn't fix what I did, but hopefully it makes things a bit better. Let's be off, brother. Your hammer. Thanks! Might not mean much with Odin's goons stomping around the city, but folks see this and they'll know we haven't completely given up. Not yet. <sighs> Never expected to see this thing again. Ah, uh, lungs. That, no, that's rubbish. What? Brock's bloody riddle. What gets bigger the more you take away? I can't let that blue twat beat me. If you are this upset, he already has. Expanded my wares. If you got the raw materials to make them. Can't believe we missed this. Uh, what's the witch of the woods need? The ace here will be running scared. And Lady Freya? Ready when you are. You won't get so much as a paper cut in that. That'll keep your bits in all the right places. Good or what? Very good. We got more lip.
nothing to do or no? <laughs> Now that you have a weapon to deal with Heimdall, we just need to find a way to get to him. Aye, if that's still the plan. It is. I will protect my son. So, it seems the original plan to avoid Ragnarok has fallen a bit by the wayside. That is a Odin. Yes, that's rather what concerns me. Listen, brother. Those things he said to you... His words are nothing. True, though I expect retaliation is no empty threat. We need to think through the ins and outs of it. You're getting ahead of yourself. Let's see if Sindri has had any luck. Hello! Good to see the chimes working as intended. About Nithog, you should know. We had no choice. It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no expecting him to clean up after himself. Not all gods showed the interest that you do in righting past wrongs. I do hope you're able to locate those leaned worms. Good luck to you. Here's what I found. If I have anything else for you, you'll be the first to know. What a rambunctious bunch. There he is! Hey! Come show off the spear! See what we done! Now do the thing! Oh, look at that! She's special, that one. Ain't gotta tell me. Have you found a way to reach Asgard? Um, not as such. Had a few ideas, but they didn't so much... work. <sighs> Brother, without a way to Asgard, what are we doing? I do not know. I need to think. I am... tired. Where are you going, brother? Sleep. So, we're just keeping blindly on then. Hoping we don't walk headlong into Ragnarok. Is that your plan?
You all right? Well, your father seems very ready to go. Shall we then? Do you enjoy the gentle waves, little one? Father and I traverse this river often. One day, you will learn to navigate its waters. We live deep in the wild woods. The most beautiful forest in all of Midgard. And it is safe and serene here. Game is plentiful. And you will want for nothing. We're not far from the place your father and I first met. We nearly took each other's heads off. But he's softened since then. Somewhat. Fortunately for you, he remains dreadfully stoic. <sighs> I suppose it will fall to me to teach you language. Your father can teach you to hunt. Perhaps that will fall to me as well, since all he seems to be good for is grunting. Have you nothing to say to your son? What would you have me say, Faye? Anything. Let him learn your voice. Let him know you. It is far better off knowing as little as possible. Knowledge is not always a burden. To think the mighty god of war, frightened of his own child. I do not fear our child, Bay. I fear for him. He is innocent. We are not our failures. We are not who we were. We must be better. is our future. Keep him safe, Kratos. Protect our son.
What did that wall ever do to you? Um, building focus. Something my father taught me. <laughs> it work? Not yet. So, what you focusing on anyway? Controlling my emotions. Heimdall keeps trying to make me lose my cool. Ugh! I can't give in to it. Dude, hey. It's true. Hey, be cool. Training without me? <laughs> that a that a good idea? Training? I mean, I, I think it's a great idea, but uh, won't your mom be mad if she finds out? Good point. But did you consider? Oh, no, <laughs> it didn't. It didn't hurt. Also. Mm -hmm. Anyways, grandfather wants to see you. Oh, grandfather. Right. Okay. Uh, here, then take this. And, uh, send my regards to Sif, Lady Sif. And, uh, Treyas, see you later. And Throod. Bye, Throod. <laughs> Midgardian boys are so weird. Weird can be good. This is the two of you, I swear. What's in the jar? Milk curd, mom's favorite. It's his way of helping. Grandfather's in his study. Catch up later. It's a lot more complicated than you think. You don't need to know why, but I'm old enough. This isn't about your age. Then what is it about? Because by this point, Magni and Modi were set on the path that led to their death. I don't understand. You never try to. Then help me. Why are you so intent to walk the same path? And with that boy, no less. It's not about him. I just... This is my dream. Haven't you ever? You're not some farmhand. We're Aesir. We have duties, not dreams. And you need to start acting like it. Sometimes I hate you. Sif in Thor's room. Everyone back home would freak if they knew I was in here. Wait, what am I doing in here?
Huh. Not here. Maybe Odin's down in this library. What are you going on about? I just don't get it. The mask. Bringing the giant that killed my sons here. Why? <laughs> I can explain it to you, but I can't understand it for you. Stop letting your wife think for you. She's clouding whatever's left of your brain. This isn't about her. No, it's about your limitations. Accept them and move on. Now go smash something, will you? Honestly, I like you better as a drunk. Finally figured it out. This is where you killed Amir, isn't it? The first giant. Tell me, can you murder a landslide, smother a storm? It was more a force of nature, a vessel of power. I was young, foolish, saw an opportunity to create something more. I know you think it's cruel, but I did what I had to to protect my own. Why build your house here? What's in there? I'm gonna trust shh, you. Shh, shh. I'm trying to tell you. In the wake of Amir's death, I saw something, the rift, possibly the birthplace of reality. I looked inside and something was there looking back at me. It whispered to me. Things I couldn't possibly comprehend, but I knew they were true. When it blinded me, I thought it was over that I'd never see inside again. And then I found this. And I knew that it would finally let me see the answers. You see, son, I don't know where I go when I go. There's no Valhalla for me. Ragnarok cannot be the end. I need to know there's something more than this. I need to know... what happens to me. And that's the truth, I swear, on my last good eye. That's the truth. The writing on here... talks about a cold breath. Breath. Wind. It's gotta be Helheim. Helheim, you say? I'll take it. And I know just the person to accompany you. I'm trusting you two can handle this responsibility. You can count on us. Oh, I uh, forgot to mention, Heimdall will be joining you. What a privilege. For all of us. Oh, whoa, 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 hold up. You don't want to walk into the blistering cold of Helheim without this. Every Lao should keep you nice and toasty. You're welcome. Huh. Vermeer said even Odin couldn't survive the cold in Helheim. You believe everything that old goat says? Rude. Too bad your first time outside Asgard has to be to Helheim. Nah, we're gonna make the most of this. <sighs> now, as much as I would love to babysit, I have something else to do for the Allfather. If you run into any trouble, just scream so I know where to find your bodies. Find that masterpiece. Finally, I can test my skills alongside the real Valkyrie expert. First off, Hellwalkers are nothing compared to Valkyries. Second, I thought you didn't believe me. Hellwalkers, here's your chance. The Alpha! Ooh, that one looks like it hurts! <laughs> 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 
For the record, I believe you fought the Valkyries. I just don't believe it was Grandfather who corrupted them, or that he caused the desolation in Midgard, or that he had all the giants killed. Am I missing anything? Uh, lots, actually. Crimes is my grandfather committed. Let's see. He decimated Vanaheim, tortured Tyr, murdered Groa, murdered Amir. It goes on and on. Interesting. And where'd you hear all this? Freya and Amir told me. Oh, so his traitorous ex-wife and a bitter former advisor. Got it. Look, you don't believe me, but... No, I don't. Either you're full of crap or you're a hypocrite for helping him. Can we just focus on the mission? Where the mask said to go? Let's double back. We'll find a way around. See? More hellwalkers! That means we're headed the right way! Sure. There's a big hole up there now. Could be our way around. I got this. Uh-huh, sure you do. Hey, we're okay, right? I guess. I mean, we are families are just meant to be enemies. Well, not us. I don't believe that. What I do believe is that you'll make a great Valkyrie. I'll tell your mom the same thing. 
Even if she scares the life out of me. Now, we have a masterpiece to find. No way through up here either. Now what? I'm not sure. But my gut's telling me what we need is here. Stone. Why didn't I see that? Didn't think I was all muscle, did you? It fell through the floor! Could be our way up. Let's head back down and find out. <laughs> now we go right. with all these buildings in the way, but I think we're going the right way. You think? So this way? Uh, sure. Are you messing with me? I need this to go well. I need my family to see what I can do. I know. We both do. Mask? Uh, looks like it's through here. Let me get that for you. Okay, this thing is really 
fighting me? See anything in there? There. Nice. Whatever you shot crashed through the floor again. Let's head back and check it out. So, I talk about my mom a lot. What's your dad like? He's intense. Like he's trying to force me into this mold. But I'm not sure it's me. Oof. Well, I know exactly what that's like. Thing is, I don't know what I want. I love that you do. You'll figure it out. Doesn't. Mom's gonna have a real tough time keeping me in Asgard after this. Which way? The mask showed it was straight ahead earlier. Of course, always blocked. Maybe. I bet there's another way around. So, how'd you know you wanted to be a Valkyrie? I didn't always. After a bad fight with Mom, I snuck out and found them training. Somehow, every movement they made had such purpose. Like they knew exactly where they needed uh, to be. Looks like it's through here. Too heavy? Shut up. Something's blocking it. I'll take a look. But I want to hear the rest. Deal. Jump. Not bad. I know. As I was saying, seeing the Valkyries fight, all the strength and style, and it gave me clarity. For the first time, I saw my path forward. Clear as day. Too bad giants have to follow prophecy. Who cares? Make your own path, just like we've been doing here. <laughs> now let's see. Step aside, little man. Uh, this one's stuck too! But I feel it weakening. Maybe I should just shut up and concentrate. Maybe I should just shut up and concentrate. Sure looks like it. Bring it on! Oh! 
Still here, but it's blocked. What if I move? Aha! Uh -huh. Can you get up there? See if you can find a way to cut the crate down on the other side. I'll wait here. I don't have a fancy way up like you do. Got it, Ingrid. Was I too rude about her grandfather? She should know the truth, right? Yeah, guess so. Hey, you talking to me? Uh, no, just talking to Ingrid. Okay, well, I'm waiting. Get a better view of that crate. Yoffa! You did it! Better get back. Hey, what's going on out there? You okay? I got it! Attaboy, Loki! Mess him up! <laughs> Open. Let's go. Whoa, the mask is freaking out. We must be close. <gasps> Who's that? Don't look at me. You're the one who's been here before. It's probably nothing. Doesn't sound like nothing. Yep. Well, you gotta get out of here. But the mask. We're so close. Besides, I don't think it's dangerous. Are we looking at the same thing? Maybe he's locked up for a good reason. I can feel what he's feeling. It's a giant thing. Look, he just wants to be free. The peace must be behind him. Trust me. All right, let's start with the lock not near its teeth. Like 
there was another one under his foot. in the chamber he was guarding. A dead end? Please tell me it's down in the water or something. There's... How? It's not responding anymore. This has never happened. But you said trust you. And we let that thing loose. Grandfather's gonna kill me. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Through. Wait up. Maybe we missed it. Maybe it's back here somewhere. Through. Through. It's it's gonna be okay. How I, can you say that? I shouldn't have listened to you. Look, if I made a mistake, I'll fix it. I can find the piece. You absolute unqualified moron. You know that thing tears holes between realms, right? <gasps> well, I suppose I should expect nothing less from half-breeds. Don't call me a half-breed. <clears throat> I will call you whatever I like, Junior. Leave him alone. It was a mistake. No! The mistake was allowing you to think that you were ready. You helped him, didn't you? What side are you on anyway, Guppy? Try me and find out. Oh. <laughs> and what are... you going to do exactly? <sighs> you see... Everyone takes it easy on you, because they are afraid of your father. I am not. That fat, drunken, utter piece of trash! Hey! Again! Yes, yes, the dumb does not fall far from the tree. Very well, then. Give me your best shot. have a lot to learn, little girl, starting with who your family is and who it is not. Just wait until I'm a Valkyrie. <laughs> oh. You really believe the Allfather would allow that to happen? <sighs> Please. Do not let this little weasel feed your delusions any longer. Enough! <laughs> so close. Stop! He just wants to make you mad. Yeah? Well, it worked. <sighs> well, uh, you toddlers are boring. If you are finished throwing your little tantrum, we should go now. Because I cannot wait to watch you explain this mess to the Allfather. Oh, it's going to be glorious. Hoogan! He's not here. Let's check his study. Oh, boy, is he going to lose it. Father will have my back. After the Allfather sent him away sulking with his tail between his legs? Doubtful. And you, Loki of the Jotnar, I am haunted by your incompetence. It keeps me up at night. Whatever. <laughs> no, I, seriously, I, I find the hues and shades of your shortcomings almost... Moving. If we could only somehow harness your uselessness, we could fuel this entire city. Fine. It's all on me. Just leave her out of it. I don't need your help, Loki. Sorry. 
Save it for the All Father. We have a lot to discuss. Loki, I'll meet you in your room when I'm finished here. Shouldn't be long. Okay. My mission went quite well, All Father. Secured the item we discussed. The mask, on the other hand, well, they are merely children. Thanks a lot. Throod, I... I don't want to hear it. Everything was fine until you showed up. I'll make it up to you, I swear. I don't really want to talk right now. What did you think would happen? She hates me, Thor. My, you can't keep undermining me like that. Training her behind my back? She's gonna do what she wants. Wouldn't you rather I at least help? Know where she's going, keep her safe? No, I'd rather us be a team. I'd like you to back me up for once. You're ruining what little relationship I have left with her. I'm doing the best I can to keep this family. If that was true, you stand up to your father for once in your life. I really messed up. It's times like this, I really miss home. Ingrid, did you have a home? Before you came here? Someone who took care of you? That sounds like a yes. Maybe I could help you find them without, you know, screwing it up. Sound like a plan? Come in. I heard what Heimdall had to say. I'd like to hear it from you. What happened? It wasn't there. I was wrong. Well, we all make mistakes, son. But freeing Garm, <laughs> that was a big one. Chaos is already spilling out into the other realms. We're safe here in Asgard, but everywhere else. I think I want to go home now. OK, if that's what you want. I meant it when I said you're not a prisoner here. It's your choice. Go, clear your mind. I know you'll be back. But before you go, I'll need the mask back. It's not that I don't trust you, you understand. It's the company you keep. Oh, and Ingrid? Loki, when you do decide you're ready to continue our work here, Hugen will be waiting for you in your old home. You screwed up. Doesn't change the fact that you're welcome here. Oh, and say hi to Mimir for me.
course. Mr. Gateway, quick. Odin was right. Freeing Garm. How did I screw up so badly? Almost home. It's gonna be fine. Everything's fine. No, no, no! It's you! Wait! You! Atreus! Watch out! Where are you going? I'm trying to find a way to you! You mind? We're being attacked right now! This won't stop until I close that cell. Atreus, help keep them off me! Ha ha ha! 
Over. No thanks to you. Where is Atreus? Atreus? Has the runaway returned and brought all this with him? <laughs> Just hold still. I told you I'm fine. Oh, you're bleeding. And quit your blubbering. So my fault. The Hellwalkers. They're everywhere. Everywhere. That is not your fault. Yes, it is. There was a wolf in hell. It was in chains and. And I set him free. I, I thought that if. Garm! Great bleeding fuck lad, you freed Garm! Garm? Who freed Garm? That's madness. Surely not you, young one. If the Hound of Hell is loose, he'll chew through the fabric of the realms. Hellwalkers are just the beginning. What were you thinking? Aye, this is a fuck-up of not insignificant proportions. What would drive you to such mischief? Is this Loki's doing? Enough. Leave him. Atreus has made a mistake. One that we will fix together. Grand. Now, if you don't mind, I'd rather stay here. I've had my fill of visits to Helheim. One problem. Excuse I'm not sure I have a way back to Elon. Perhaps the squirrel does. I need to speak with you at once. At once, I say. 